Tone check, tone check. Yes, I can hear me. Okay. Now that we're live, I'm going to share this to other people. Tone check, tone check. Yes, I can hear me. Now that we're live, I'm going to share this to the future. Yes, I can hear me. Okay. Now that we're mute this. All right. It's been a while, guys. <laughs> Let's get some links onto here. Check it. Uh, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Check it out. Check it out. See if there's any live comments here. Nothing yet. Perfect. And this is it. Okay. Sharing this to the guys. Sorry, okay, just sharing it. Share, 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 share it to these people here. Perfect. Okay, sorry about that. Rough start. Where are we here? Perfect. Okay, let's screen share. Which one are we screen sharing? Click analytics. Okay, see that? Perfect. So today I'm gonna to drop shipping with Bobby live, sourcing Home Depot items for eBay drop shipping. Okay, and what I do is I usually go to the Home Depot website first, and maybe look through this. Ooh, a gift under one hundred dollars. Sure, let's do that. And and I just want to update you guys on the status of my thing here of what's going on, okay? I mean, let's do that first. Since I haven't been really on YouTube, I'm gonna share this with you guys, okay? Do another screen share. It's gonna be this one here. Let me make sure nothing is showing. Yep, nothing is showing. As you can see here, my sales, the past 31 days is 44,000. Um, if you guys have seen my previous video, I was doing only like 5,000. So how did I do this? Um, it's 154 now, um, it, and I only got $261 in, but that's fine. The last seven days, it's been $12,900. 12, so if you do the math, Sure, if you guys will be able to see this calculator here. Let me check. No, all right, let me share the other screen. Hi, <laughs> entire screen. Sure. So, if you guys were to look at this here 12,936 divided by seven days, that's 1,800 per day. And if you do by the 30, 31 day, you do the five, two, three, and then 31 days, 
1400 a day. Uh, if you do the that by 90 days, it's about 951 a day. Not bad, huh? $44 compared to the $5,000 I did um, the month before I went to Nicaragua. If you guys remember, you can see the video. <laughs> but yeah, that's my update here. And these are real numbers, see? June 11, 2019, $3,000 a day on Tuesday. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Let's go back to. All right. If you guys are curious of how I actually do this, um, while we're here, I might as well, right? You guys are interested in how I do this. I do drop shipping with Bobby. Basically, it's a live case study where I show you how. Basically, how I uh, uh, drop ship See, right here. So, show you how my tips and tricks on how to do this on drop shipping with Bobby, the website. Live case study, $20 a month. Um, yeah, just sign up if you guys are interested. I basically go through from start to finish. I started a new store. You'll see how I. You actually see how I um, started the store, how I list, how I do customer service, how I fulfill orders. I reveal all my secrets. And essentially, um, yeah, I don't hold anything back. Fulfill orders, upload tracking, where I get my um, items, exact items, things like that. If you're interested, um, just let me know. Join our Facebook group down below. It's free. Um, and the link down below for the drop shipping is free as well, um, is down below as well. Drop shipping live with Bobby. Okay. Now back to this. Let's go with Milwaukee. Milwaukee is a good brand. All right. So I'm just gonna click on one of these here. Copy the title here. Go to eBay, paste it, and there we are. Okay, and what I'll do is I want to find out okay, what is my profit margin, what do I want it to be, the $99, sales, calc. Calc, yep. Yeah. eBay. So if the cost is 99 97 and if you guys are on dropshipping from Home Depot, I recommend being tax exempt or else you guys won't be able to compete. And if you want a desired profit of, we'll say, 10%. You need the price to be $130.50. All right. So if you want to filter this by 150, I said. You guys seeing this? Just want to make sure you guys are seeing this. Yes, you guys are seeing this. Perfect. So 130. And. Make sure it is new. Make sure. Okay. So you see these people here are drop shippers. Most likely look at the image. Um, so if you want, we can definitely click on one of these sellers here. All right, and go ahead and swipe this fella here. Copy. I don't know what that noise is. It's probably background noise over there. Sorry, guys. Okay. All right.
that's okay, I guess. All right. So we use the competitor research. We'll go ahead and paste the seller here. Sorry, guys, if this is you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sometimes it takes 24 hours to view. What is that? All right. Let's go for the next guy. 2.30 here. All right. Let's see what this person. Like I said, if this is you, I'm sorry, guys. Just for the greater good. Greater good and drop shipping community here. No selling period. So he might be new. How about this person? Okay. Didn't, didn't do that, right? One point eight, three items sold. Nothing that I care about. Okay, next one. So it's the same person. All right, next one. Next one. And next one. Oh, don't want you guys to open up the window there. And next one. And the next one. And these are more optimized titles because you could tell it's different. So you may want to go with those too. All right, let's try this first though. All right, we tried that. He's nothing there. We already tried this person. All right, we tried that person. Ooh, newer person. All right, let's see here. Who are you here? Research, search. So, guys. That means a lot of people are sniping right now, probably. <laughs> How about this one? Usually this doesn't happen. It's kind of strange. But yeah, uh, any questions, just comment down below. If you're catching this live, hashtag live. If not, um, hashtag replay. And give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see more of these. Let's take a look at this. All right. So he sold this four times. So that's something I would list. Anything four times or more. All right. Let's see. Let's search here. This is a Home Depot item. Oh, why don't you look at that? Two oh one ninety nine. Two oh one ninety nine. All right. So we get this for two hundred one ninety nine. Let's do this again. Two hundred one ninety nine. You need to break even. You need two sixty two to get that. Now what is he selling it for? Two eighteen. Two eighteen. Two eighteen. Two eighteen. All right. And actually sell it for two eighteen. What will you get? Negative profit. Negative profit here. No good. Break even. 232. I need 232 to sell that. No good. Next one. How about this one? Again, guys, people ask me all the time, what do I sell? What do I say? What do I sell whatever sells. And they just laugh. I'm like, seriously, what do, what do you sell? That's the honest answer. I don't care what it is. I mean, unless it's harmful or something, then I wouldn't sell it. But most of the time, I sell whatever sells, guys. You know what I mean? Like, I, I look it through. 
use Zeek Analytics as a research tool, see how many times it sells. If it's more than four times it, uh, within the last 30 days, I'm selling it. All right, deliver your options. Be careful with these guys. Oh, ground shipping is actually free. Good. Free, free, free. Actual free shipping. Okay, and how much did he sell it for? He or she, sorry guys. 2232, 2232 across the board. Okay. 2067. 22. Yeah, not happening. Not happening here. Oh wait, I do have a store subscription that changes a little bit. That's about it. <laughs> Not happening in this one. Sorry guys. Not this one. Next one. So you can tell this person isn't a good seller. AKA not um, profiting, right? So but if you go here. You already know what your break even is. And let's go back and go back. Oh. Uh oh. Wrong thing, right? Store subscription. Okay. He's the only guy with the title, so that doesn't help. All right. On to the next seller then. So, no. And no, I just did that one. And no, I just that, did that one. Okay, next one. So these are the optimized titles. All right, you can tell they switched it up a little bit um, compared to Milwaukee Hold Those or General Purpose. Right, then he had an electrician. Uh, it's a 19 piece kit. It's not the right one. The 20 piece kit. This, they don't even say anything there. <laughs> All right, so let's drill through this. Open new tab, open link in new tab. This, I'm not sure what that is. I'm not sure what that is. This was the same. Open any new tab. Open a new tab. Open a new tab. And all we know is this is a Home Depot item. We don't know if it's a drop shipper or not. Look through here. This may be a drop shipper, it may not. Um, but we'll go I'm gonna go ahead and just check it out. See here. Copy that. Paste that and enter. Copying, copying, and copying here. Okay, 17%, so 500, 17,000 sales. And we'll see. Same, that was live on here. Perfect. Again, any questions, let me know in the live chat. Or if it's a replay, just, um, you know, comment down below. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Dun, 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 Home Depot. Do you find someone that's Home Depot? It's most likely a Home Depot item. <laughs> Delivery options. Are you ready? Dun, 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 dun. What's going on? Oh, here we go. Five ninety nine for delivery. Okay. So let's go to handy dandy calculator here. It costs you nine ninety seven. Shipping cost is five ninety nine, and the break even is eighteen seventy seven. How much is this guy selling it for? Not. Sixteen ninety nine, sixteen ninety nine. Nope, no good. All right, on to the next one. 
How about the Milwaukee? All right, let's see. Search to the next tab, Home Depot, 14 pieces, correct. 39 plus 599, 3988, 32, it's only at 4, 55, 99, 55, 99, 55, 99. You make a 5% margin. Hmm, it's not bad. 5% margin, and if you have, okay, so 5% margin, imagine that, okay? Um, and you will have, so 3.98 times 5.99. If you're using, oh, that is not right. 39.88 plus 5.99 is 45.87. Using discounted gift cards through We'll say card bazaar or something like that, and you're getting a yeah. giving assistant.org. You look up Home Depot, you're getting about an 8%, up to 8%. Well, we'll say 4% to be conservative, okay? Um, or plus, yeah, let me get you this. So 4% plus, we'll say 6% from Card Bazaar is a 10%, right? So 10% of this, kind of times it by 90 because that'll be 90% of the value. 41, right, 41, 41. What did I say? 4130, we'll say. And that's a 13.2% margin. You guys see how I did that? Returns 15%. Margin is actually 13%. So if you do do the cashback game, this is highly profitable. All right. On to the next one. So that I'd probably list because I do have access to those things. It sold nine times at the last. How many days? I don't even know. So say it sold nine times, okay? And you just got $7.40. $7.40 times nine. Um, in that 30 days, you get $66 from this one item. How's that sound? Good, right? Now, if you have 50 of these, 50 of these items, you'll get to 3330 See how that works? Or if you have, I'm sorry, 7.4 times 9. If you have items like this that, that, that you have, maybe you, you aren't doing so much, and you have 15 items like that, that's about $1,000, okay? So it's very conservative. Um, and if you guys like this kind of content, and, and if you think this is a good strategy, and you want to see more, um, like I said, I am doing a live case study that's ongoing right now, drop shipping with Bobby, and I go through this in more examples, and I do this on a daily basis. So my my um, members of the drop shipping community get this for free every day, as long as you're a member. All right, um, and I share a lot more tips and tricks and you actually see my items that I actually list, and I show you how I list. But for this purpose, for today, I just want to show you how I source, and if you guys enjoy that, um, yeah, sign up in the link below. And if you think this is good content, give me a thumbs up, uh, subscribe with the notification bell. Hmm. All right, 14.97 here. Plus, usually five ninety nine. Sometimes it's like six dollars or something weird like that. So that's why I just check, double check. All right, so that's fourteen ninety seven. And you see the trend of this guy. He likes to do under forty five dollars, and 
maybe pocket on the shipping, which is five ninety nine. So say that he had enough orders that will make his cart shopping cart more than forty five dollars, then he'll profit five ninety nine more. You know what I mean? All right, I'll show you the example now, actually. Let's see. I'm just saying sell. Okay, what's going on here? How's my internet? Yeah, that's good. Okay. Twenty ninety nine. Twenty ninety nine. This guy is playing the ninety nine game. <laughs> All right, he's not making that much here. On this one, at least. Okay, on to the next one. So if he didn't pay for shipping, I'm sure it was going to make out. Yeah, it's going to make out with those shipping. So we add that, okay? So if we added that, you want that last example, right? About forty-five dollars, right? Forty-five dollars minus five ninety-nine. You get the thirty-nine oh one. Or I could just like no, I can't save it. All right, just say oh maybe this one. Nine seven. No, that's not it. Well, just say if the item you added a cart that was over. Let's say forty-five minus. So if you added a thirty dollar item, okay, plus fourteen ninety seven, it'll be forty five dollars, right? You'll save that four ninety nine, uh, five ninety nine. But think about it, you're not paying five ninety nine, but you're calculating that into the cost of your item. So if you have two items, you just double the five ninety nine. That's an extra eleven dollars and ninety eight cents. Here, guys. Guys, don't understand that. Comment down below. I can go through that calculation again. Essentially, every time someone does this calculation, they add five ninety nine to that price because they assuming they're gonna pay. Okay. But ever if ever after you have forty five dollars or more, you get free delivery. So you don't have to pay that five ninety nine. And like I said, if that's two items, times that by two, it's eleven ninety eight. Extra eleven ninety eight profit on top of your top end margin. All right. So I wouldn't list that because that was a negative. Okay, how about four times? Okay, good. Sold four times in the last thirty days and fourteen sold total. All right, let's, let's see here. Copy and paste, Home Depot, yes. 2369, let's see. 2369, also it's a 599 item. Shipping. Oh, I'm sorry. It's wrong. 23.99. 69.599. Shipping, we don't charge. And he sold it for thirty four ninety nine. Thirty four ninety nine. And that makes sense. Thirty item cost twenty three ninety nine. Right now it's thirty four ninety nine. Rick Evans thirty four. 34. Oh, yeah. See, I don't know why that was like that. <laughs> Break even is that. Perfect. Okay. It's a 1% margin. Um, personally, I wouldn't list that. But if you were to use discount gift cards, and we'll say discount gift cards and giving assistant, that's just 90% of the cost. Would be twenty six dollars, twenty six seventy two. 
Rotate A. Okay, why is this not uploading, updating here? 26, there we go. 10% margin. So maybe I would list this if I'm using my strategy. Huh. And if I were to play that, okay. They'll get that. They'll get that. $3.51 times five. It's actually $17. That's not bad. Or times four, actually. Huh? Sorry. Three fifty one times four. It's fourteen dollars extra. Covers your subscription fee, I guess. <laughs> uh, and if you guys don't like that, I mean, you guys can do higher ticket items. But to start out, maybe just do lower ticket items just to get used to it. And uh, like all these things, you can actually technically sell, right? Yeah. And let's see here. Let's copy that. Paste it. Home Depot. Oh, shocking. Home Depot. <laughs> you guys, you start from Home Depot and you just keep going from there. And then, let's see here. Twenty-two seventy-five. I saw twenty-two seventy-five plus five ninety-nine. Person sold it for. See, that's accurate. Thirty two ninety nine, thirty nine nine, yes, 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 yes. Thirty two ninety nine, yes, 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 yes. But update because my computer is slow. Thirty three thirty one. So not a profitable item unless you are combining this order. Let's assume we're not, so nope. All right, and I'll go through all these, you know, four. If you want, you look at the higher ticket item, 55 here, and you scan. What that does is it'll scan the titles through eBay, and you'll find out which one, which one you want to look at. Just click all of the items and run a Zeek. Um, pretty much a microscope to do product research on that. This is how much it sold. Um, it's a refresher, okay? A refresher of how much it cost. Um, let's see here. Search. Let's see how we're we doing for time here. I don't know when I started. Oh well. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Sorry. Thirty-nine. Thirty-nine eighty-eight. Five ninety-nine shipping. Fifty-two seventy-eight. Okay, fifty-two seventy-eight. So fifty-five ninety-nine. It's a five percent margin. But if you want a ten percent margin. Fifty nine, fifty six, okay. Fifty nine, sixty six, fifty. Okay. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. One, two, two, one, one, one. Not bad here. Um, fifty five, ninety nine here. That's a guy. Uh, nothing else really. You do it by the price. I mean. If you're looking at, if you need $59, let us go to $59, all right? $59, $59. Look at that. Scan him. 
I'm sorry, let's walk through. I forgot I need to walk through this. <laughs> 59. Um, 31 feedback. Didn't sell this, but his margin is about 10%. So this little spy guy here, <laughs> it's basically you click on it and it, it will uh, scan the competitor. Okay. Only sold four. Active listings 284. Not so good. <laughs> But look at this. You can use this to um, work with um, everything else here. So update uploaded. It only sold once. Uploaded only sold once. But it's total sold. That's a, that's a pretty good thing there. All right, let's see. Let's scan this. Search through all these people. So there's seven here. Technically, you need to go in and then um, search the competitor first the eBay drop shipper or seller. But the easiest way is to check all to Zeek selection, which pretty much will run these sellers again. A feed, what's going on? You can combine two orders, send them to two zero. That way you can say shipping fees. Correct, sir. Correct. Question was if you do the five ninety nine, yes and yes. Yes and yes. Let me show you the example. So in this case I were to add this to the cart. Check out as a guess. So see that five ninety nine cost there? Okay, thirty nine eighty eight. We'll say that we will one second to charge okay so let's edit the cart and then say we added any item i don't know let's say tool. To, let's add a tool all right anything 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 hand tool sure i mean you'll get something that's I'm just picking up random items, for example, guys. So we say we got the Stanley. <clears throat> okay. Actually, no. Stanley's not a good. Let's go back to hand tools. Something cheaper. We'll say a needle nose plier. Okay. $18. Oh, $19. There we go. All right. So you notice, like I said, the $5.99. It was $5.99. With just that chip. All right, let me open my card to show you guys what I'm talking about here. A lot of windows open. That's how I operate. Multitask, guys. Good lesson. Okay. See how that's 39.88, right? And and 5.99. Okay. So 5.99 from this ship, right? Because it's not over 45 dollars. And then obviously 1997 free shipping uh, on $45 items. So your listings should just have this here, free listing or free delivery over $45. And this would cost $5.99. No surprise, right? $5.99. So you have now you have two $5.99s, right? Okay. So once you add this. To the cart, <coughs> so once you add this to the cart, you go to checkout. Check out as a guest. Look at that, free shipping, free shipping, free shipping. So instead of getting charged $5.99 plus $5.99, um, you pocketed an extra eleven ninety eight. Does that make sense? And to ship to different addresses, you're going to put ship to multiple addresses. But you have to complete it. So eBay drop shipping, eBay drop. At gmail.com, 
whatever. I don't know. And drop shipping central Ave. Something, something, something. O two one one five. Something, something, something. Ship to multiple addresses. And there you go. Add a new one there. Um, customer number two. 800, 23, something, something, something. 100, uh, Milwaukee Drive. Oh, two, 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 five, whatever, whatever, whatever. Boston, Boston. And there you go. Multiple addresses. Um, uncheck the billing address, put your payment info. Uh, if you have gift cards, you can apply a gift card here. Um, that's about it, guys. That's how you do it. So. Uh, let's go back to that 1997 $5.99 shipping, and you sell it for a 10% margin. We'll say $34, right? So $4. Damn. In this case, this is a 10% margin because your store is running under a 10% margin, right? But. You just got rid of this shipping cost by adding another item so it could combine be over $45, right? And you just boost that to 27%. Got it? And the same with the other item. So this item is $39.98 plus the $5.99 shipping. And like I said, you do about 10%, so $59, as shown in my other example, with a 9% margin, but you combine that with a second Home Depot order. You save on the $5.99, and you get a 19% margin. You see how that works? Um, yeah, so that's the power of Home Depot. Mm, increase the wait time. We, we could bring this into our private Facebook group. Um, but yeah, the gist of it is, no, I wouldn't increase the handling time just because that might decrease your sales. Um, I would just sell like normal. And as you build your store with these type of items, um, eventually it will increase your profit margin. So, I mean... You don't want to. Sometimes this doesn't work out for you when it begin in the beginning. But what I realize is your sales traction or sales velocity, right? Well, actually, uh, it's more important than making the extra five ninety nine because eventually you will make that extra five ninety nine by by month two or month three, especially the way you're going to feed. The feed is one of my uh, drop shipping live with Bobby members and he, he's killing it first month following the method and I, I am very impressed shout out to you Hafid good job man um, probably get you on the channel soon just to interview and see how how everything is but yeah guys that's that's the gist of free shipping and Home Depot but all right let's let's go back into sourcing that gets sidetracked sorry guys <laughs> sidetracked all right Let's get into this, okay? And then um, find out what this item is. So see how I just started with one item in Home Depot and just spidered off of all these people here, all these uh, listings? This might be a Walmart, it might be an Amazon. Is it a Walmart or an Amazon? Let's see here. 13.8, 11.9, 19.7. Sometimes it's best just to do that. And I don't see it here. Well, that looks exactly the same. 19.7, uh, 13.8, 11.8. Yep. Best protect, protect your assets. 
that's protect protect your assets easy to install easy to access large capacity yes yes and yes yes this is the one all right so this is 64.99 free delivery so if you want to go to my handy dandy sales calculator here 64.99 i said yep 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 correct and 84 margin or 84 buy it now to make a 10 percent margin Okay, so I'm looking for someone that's selling this $84, okay? And he's selling for $85. Awesome. $89.99, $89.99, perfect. All right, so let's... He's good, he's selling it. Let's scan him. Did we scan him already? I think that's him, right? Yeah, we scanned him. All right, how about we do this by the price here? 187. That's crazy. Mm, all right, let's scan this guy. 187. 187. That's like um. That's ridiculous. Oh no, sorry, that's the wrong one. 187. That's um. 52 percent margin. That doesn't look right. Let's see what's going on here. Oh, not bad, not bad. Multimedia. All right, let's take a look at this. Multimedia. Walmart. Let's get that out of here. Fifty-nine ninety-eight. Sure, it's the same thing here. Sixteen by twelve point five, eight point five. Nothing here. Sixteen, twelve point five, eight point five. Yep. Yep. All right. Fifty-nine ninety-eight. Fifty-nine ninety-eight. Break even seventy-seven. What are you selling for? 68, hmm, that's kind of low. All right, say 68, what's that though? Negative one. I don't know how he's doing that. But on to the next item, couldn't list something like that, you know what I mean? Next item, engine starter, out of stock. Search engine, search, 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 Amazon. Okay, what's the brand on this? Coher Courage. Coher Courage. Yeah, that's it. Okay. It's the same thing. Looks the same. Right, Amazon is 52.45. You're selling it for forty eight ninety nine. Doesn't sound right. Not doing this one. All right, next one. Sold six times. Boys, bike. I guess. Yeah. Looks like that's the title. I mean, you guys could do this and look at the title and just see that you know that's clearly a manufacturer's title. Um, probably a Walmart item. Yep, one more item. Perfect. All right, just to make sure it's still streaming. Seventy-eight dollars. Perfect. Eighteen inch. Eighteen inch. All right, let's see. Seventy-eight dollars. Seventy-eight dollars. Break even is. Oh, profit is a hundred dollars. Selling it for $94.99, which is pretty good still, right? $94.99. 5% margin, $5. Yep, $5. And how many times did it sell? 
One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll say six times, right? So if you want to go to five dollars times six times, that's thirty dollars in the past thirty months. I mean thirty days. Um and that's not bad. Thirty dollars for now. It's a good start. All right. And then maybe this one. So so in the last five days right there. Then we'll just go and I'm gonna paste the thing here. The hundred hundred pound. Yep, yeah, there we go. And then it is a forty seven ninety nine charge. Forty seven ninety nine charge would be break even is oh ten percent is sixty two. Also be sixty two here. Yep, that is correct. What, how much did the, he sell it for? 59. Let's double check. 59, 59, 59. Sold a lot of times. 59.95. 59.95. So 7% margin is good. Um, and if you want to see, it's a $4. $4. This person is selling it for. One, two, three, four, five, six, let's say six times, six times four dollars, twenty-four dollars. Now, in average, if you do twenty-four dollars per item, and you find, like I said, a conservative fifteen, that's three hundred fifty dollars a month. Not bad. Not bad at all. And this is top end, guys. So the back end, the front end. So the back end is a little more as well. So that's without the plot on the back end. All right, sake of the seller. Go to the next one. <laughs> yeah, you just keep on the next one. So I mean, you can definitely look at this boys bike thing, right? And then, or actually, multimedia thing if you want any of these. Uh, I think the, the last one was that one, right? All right. Scan that title. Just spider off of these titles, guys. It's all you have to do, literally. Um, and then check all. Zeke, scan these sellers for me. Thank you, Zeke. Again, Zeke is something that is very useful to me. I use that every day to do daily um, to do product research. The link is down below. Um, I appreciate it if you guys click my link guys see this content and you guys like it just um support me by using my link and we'll take it from there okay so we have this guy here so good 106 scan the title so if you go back go back here okay yeah so i have links down below for zeke analytics giving assistance mr rebate or cashback and drop shipping with Bobby down below. All right, so let's find out the price again. Run through this whole thing again. 78, 78, 78, 100. This person selling it for 106. Been selling it for 106. We'll say 106, making a 13% margin. Look at that. You can cut them to 100 and you'll be fine. Kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. <laughs> All right, guys. So, sold in April. 106, 106, 106. Good, good, good. Hey, what's up, Jay Jones? Please do another spiting off the title. I just arrived. Oh, man. You catch the replay. I will do more examples, too. No, not a problem. If you guys like this content, give me a thumbs up. If you want um, me to reveal all my secrets, Hafid knows all my secrets. We're beginning to learn all my secrets. Um, drop shipping with Bobby. Down The link is down below. And I pretty much show you how I run my store. You see everything, my store name, my items, how I fulfill, how I list. Yes, Hafid, I've been slacking off. Um, <laughs> 
I've been um, away, so I couldn't really record in the hotel room. But um, I'm back on the grind and ready to um, record more videos of me listing. But yeah, um, I actually did my last video was on um, how to avoid trans transaction defect uh, for eBay and it's very important the livelihood of your store. How not to get suspended essentially. So stay tuned. I have to upload it to the website. But yeah, let's see. So 106, right? 106, 13.8. Yep, 13.8 percent. Lost my train of thought, guys. <laughs> I swear I'll get better at this. <laughs> All right, let's see. So, so you know this person is running on a 13 percent margin. So let's scan. Okay, scan. So just to recap, so I find that this was a profitable item. And it's selling clearly by last 30 days, sold six times. And then this right here is scan title. What this essentially does is it'll copy and paste this link here. And it goes to your product research and it pastes that title on there. But instead of that, this is a shortcut. Scan title. And then bam, all the titles are here. And then what you'll do is you, there's a link that you click all. You Zeek selection this. That means it's going to scan all the sellers with the title. Um, and then you go ahead and scan this that little spy guy there, the inspector gadget guy. It means you're going to scan the competitor. And bam, 67 with $13,000. 19% sell-through rate. Pretty impressive. So now you find a guy that has a good profit margin, okay? And go ahead and keep sniping. Okay, let's see. This looks like gear wrench, gear wrench, gear wrench. Gear wrench. All right, let's see. In the live chat again. All right, let's see. Amazon, Sears. I believe this is a Sears item. 16. Yep, 16. No longer available. Okay, no longer available. That's fine. Not using this one. Yeah, let's X this out and X this out. Okay. How about this one? So at four. In the last 30 days. High ticket item. I like. All right. Sideboard vintage. Most of the time, watch. I'll show you. The question is, is the title exactly the same? Most of the time, it is. Um, yeah. That means that means that this is a high converting title. And you're just finding other drop shippers because only those drop shippers will have this type of title. Um, essentially, I mean, you can go into eBay, copy that title, and go into eBay, and it will show you. Watch out! I'll, I'll show you in a minute. Let's go through this example first. This is a Walmart item, and the color is I don't know. Weird title. Probably black. Is it even the right thing? It's not the right thing. Probably vintage red. Let's go back. This is not the same item. Okay, how about this one? Does that look the same? It does not look the same. This guy's spoofing me. Spoofing me, spoofing me, spoofing me. All right. How about I do that? That sounds more like it. And boom, there we go. Okay. 204.61. 
204 61 buy it now price is 279.82 let's confirm that they actually sold for that 279 279 yep 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 let's say it's just 279 okay and yes a 14 percent margin look at that let's list that okay and then you go on you go to the next one sold four in the last whatever times right and then let's search that all right let's get rid of this let's get rid of this better homes that might be it yep same thing 179 okay item cost is 179 sold 244 let's confirm that's 244 Oh, what's up, Jay Jones? I know who you are now. <laughs> hey, man. I snipe everyone. Sorry. Unless you give me your name and you're in my drop shipping with Bobby, and you give me your name personally, I will not snipe you. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. Dog eats dog on this world, man. It's crazy. Okay. Side pack, sorry. 179 and 244. Yes, 244. Uh, 244. Yeah, 14% margin. This guy is good. This guy is good. But yes, I would list that as well. All right, another way to spider off something. So uh, let's get rid of these Home Depot items. I'm already on the Walmart string. See how things can just convert to Walmart in like a heartbeat? <laughs> All right, so let's click this, okay? Essentially, you can do that. All right, let, let me show you product research. Okay, I think I don't need these anymore. I don't need these anymore. Essentially, you can go anywhere. <laughs> you can go anywhere here. Okay, search. All right, so optimize title. And yeah, all these are the same, but different. Look, there's a new there too. But I don't know. I like to use eBay just because you go here, copy, paste on eBay. Bam. I'm just more familiar with the eBay, I guess. So you get the exact same hits, right? And then below here, you'll get, well, there's a lot of people selling this title. There you go. You can find, copy and paste this and just add these people to your uh, your list. If um, you're pretty much shop shipping with me, you know what my list is. And then you find similar items. So results matching fewer words. So, you know, these, you know, these may not be the same titles, but they're also different um, items. Based on looking like this one, you probably know that is not a dropshipper. Oh, and it's pre-owned. This, you probably know it's dropshipper. That looks like a stock image, right? Um, pre-owned, no, 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 no. All right, look what caught my eye here, okay? Three watchers, I'll do. Uh, 52 sold. Oh, let's check that out. 52 sold. Let's see here. Okay. How oh, is this? Get to the description. <laughs> there we go. Part of description will do. Okay. See if that brings up anything. Walmart. Mm hmm. So like I said, once you guys get a pattern, you guys will know this person's a Walmart guy or a Home Depot guy or data. Never heard of that. Interesting. Anyways, let's Google search this image. See if anything comes up. Is that me? 
Hello? Well, that was weird. I heard something weird. Anyways, back to my life. Oh, wow, this guy's good at disguising stuff. Huh? Hmm. Mic, okay. So let me try something with my mic here. And that's it. Is that it here? I don't know. I'm gonna give up on this soon. <laughs> I'm gonna try this actually. All right. Did I search that already? I did. Okay. I'm gonna try to do this here. I might do that. Cover this. Let me see. I'll mute this first. Better? Put a little filter here. Is that better? I have to about the same. Uh, over here. Look at that. If we copy that, I'm sure it's not anywhere else. Anywhere else? Anywhere else? No, 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 no. Okay. 289. How much you selling for? 240? Yeah, no. Can't find it. That's fine. On to the next one. All right. I think I just messed up. What happened? <laughs> so, yeah, essentially you could do that. Um, but. Keep it simple. Just find your seller and all right. Say we want a spider off of this storage cabinet, right? Scan seller, scan title. Sorry, you find all the sellers. The seventeen drop shippers with this, because no other um, supplier or whatnot will this have this highly optimized title, right? Check that. Click Zeke selection. And then we'll go ahead and dun, 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 toad, 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 built the buy price, and uh, uh, let's, let's do this again. Let us see how much it is. I should have saved how much it was. <laughs> Sorry, guys. All right, let's see. Search. Search. That is it, 204. Item cost is 204. And you want something that's 262. Sweet spot, right? 262, 262. Any of these, that's nuts. Well, I'll definitely see. That guy, um, any of these guys, I guess. All right, so add these guys to your list, I guess. But all right, let's see. Scan this. I picked a random seller, to be honest. Oh, look at that! Whoa, 141. That's nuts. All right, let's check this guy out. So, 18 in the last 30 days. Oh, smokes. <laughs> Again, guys, if you guys don't know what Z Analytics is, it's a um, product research tool I use every day. And essentially, it will help you speed up your process of uh, sniping. Okay? Link is down below. Support me in my channel. Sign up through my link. Thanks. If you enjoy this, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. You can personalize the notification bell now. It's kind of crazy. And if you want more content like this, subscribe to my Top Shipping with Bobby. I go there on a daily basis. Um, and I post on a daily basis on our private Facebook group. Go over these things regularly. 
And these guys know Jay Jones and Hafid, they're in there. I'm a regular in there. And the questions that they have, they have direct access to me. Every hour of the day, um, if I'm working, they know they know my working schedule. They know my and if I'm not responding, I'm either working or I fell asleep. Sorry guys. That's the truth. 134 85. I'm sorry. Let's do 86. What's the break even? 111. Oh, that's crazy. Actually, 119. All right, let's go with 119. That's more realistic. Yeah, that's still good though. That's nuts. All right, 15% margin. Look at that, guys. So, um, it's coming up at the end. And. I found a bunch of <laughs> I found a bunch of items for you guys, and I feel bad because I should have did this uh, by drop shipping with Bobby Live. But as I was doing this, you know, I realized I didn't do anything on YouTube yet. I I figured I had the day off. I want to show you guys an update of my sales. Jay Jones got to catch the replay in the beginning. I showed them my sales. Blew their mind out, man. Blew their mind. Um, I guess I could end with that. Drop shipping with Bobby, twenty dollars a month. These guys got a special price because they they listed on me earlier on in the day. Um, now, guys, this price is only good for the next ten people that sign up. After that, it's gonna go up. Not sure what it's gonna go up to, but essentially, this is it. You guys have access to the members portal and everything like that. I'm gonna end with, um, yeah, guys, twelve thousand. The last seven days, 44,000. The last 31 days, 85,000. The last 90 days. And I'll end you with that. All the links are down below. And if you guys want more regular content, join my Facebook, my free Facebook group down below. Um, and I guess my announcer would have been, yeah, essentially sign up with the live case study, drop shipping with Bobby. You have me mentoring you all along the way from beginning to end. Um, I'm not familiar with a lot of issues or all the issues, but I mean, I can definitely find out more resources for you and help you resolve your problems. Um, I just want to come on today just because I haven't been on for a while for YouTube. And I actually don't plan on going on YouTube a lot for drop shipping. I'll do videos here and there, some lives here and there, but I'll be there with the live case study members, drop shipping with Bobby. I'll be with them on a daily basis or weekly basis, depending on how much they need me. Um, yeah, the private Facebook group is only for drop shipping with Bobby. Um, just because I, I need exclusivity for those people. I mean, they, they they pay a premium and I want them to have the best. And I can't give out all the secrets, reveal all my secrets to the public, you know. They don't, unfortunately, you guys don't, you guys can't do that. You guys are competing against my, with my member, my members here. So, and essentially, um, I am pivoting to do more internet marketing. Internet marketing as in uh, click funnels, affiliate marketing, um, if you guys are interested in that, again, subscribe. And like I said, my YouTube channel will be pivoting towards internet marketing um, while servicing my dropshipping with Bobby members on the website out of YouTube. But like I said, I, I, I'm probably going to um, record some eBay dropshipping tips here and there, but not as regularly as you used to. And please give me a thumbs up, comment down below. And like I said, if you guys are interested, um, just uh, the links are down below. All right, guys, have a good day. Thanks, guys, for showing up. Uh, we'll talk offline. And like I said, I'll get those videos out to you guys. Um, it, everything's already uploaded. I just have to put it on the site for you. All right, guys, have a good one.